Cardio? Check. Huh. Looks antique. I think I know someone who could help track down where this came from. A job for later. I just talked to Craig. You are not the reporter he was sending. You don't even work for Heritage Arts. Never said I did. Hi, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. You... You will not write a word of what you saw For the here. record, what do you know about the file those masked men stole? That... I, I don't... What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney. Mix? <laughs> like the last six months never happened? Since when did Mix become Italian? No idea, but I'm still glad he makes these fries. Totally. Best in the city. So, how's the grind at the Bugle? Hmm. Well... Yeah, well, I just got an all-caps text from Robbie about my so-called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. Uh, as soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So, creepy mask guys. What's your take? Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. How's, how's it going with you? Did, did you get that promotion? No, but we're on the cusp of something really big. You know Oscorp would hire you in a heartbeat, right? One phone call to hair. Sure, but Dr. Octavius's work will help millions. I'm, I'm, I'm right where I want to be, right where I should be. Almost sounds like it's more important than your other job. I've never heard you talk like that before. A well, lot can change in six months. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends? Is that what we are? I mean, we could be, you know, if, if, if that's what you wanted. <laughs> There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and uh, keys, and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. I love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites.
it's me. What's with the units heading down third? Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker! Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. Just had dinner with my ex after saving her from mass criminals. And now I'm gonna go beat up a maniac who uses shockwaves to rob people. What a perfectly normal life you have, Peter Parker. Peter, I just want to make sure you haven't left any equipment you built for your friend around the lab. It's no bother to me, but if the Grand Committee stops by again... Don't worry, Doc. I make a point not to leave anything there. But I know my friend appreciates you looking out for him. There's a lot of people who don't like him very much. That buffoon Jameson and his audience of sheep? Please. The people who do great things in this world are those who don't let bullies like him stand in their way. People like us. You said a mouthful, Doc. Take care. Stop them before they end up in driver's head videos. She wants it back because you stole it. She used it a robbery. Pull over. You tell Susie she wants to feel my back. Please tell me your horn plays, Dixie. going viral. Gotta give that wheel man props. Manhattan rush hour is no joke. Actually, I 
hideout. Just trying to make for my conversation. I'm done talking. But this could be so much more rewarding if we connected on an emotional level. Wait, I forgot. You don't have emotions. Come on, Herman. At least talk to me so we can make it interesting. Herman? What? <laughs> gotcha. Now let's talk. I said I'm done talking. Noted. Honestly, Herman, why are you robbing again? You know the police are watching your every move. I mean, we all know you're kind of dumb, but I didn't think you were this dumb. You must be desperate, which means you're not just stealing for yourself. You must be working with someone, or for someone. You can tell me who it is now, or make me punch it out of you later. Your choice. Shut it up. Move, move, move! Can't lose him. Zero personality, but your suit is awesome. Can we talk design details? <laughs> Maybe later. Good work, Spider-Man. Did you learn anything about his motive? I tried, but he's not very talkative. Plus, I think he hates me. You have that effect on a lot of people. But you love me, right, Yuri? I tolerate you. Wow. That might be the nicest thing you've ever said to me. It looks like I got some free time. Maybe now's a good time to look into that mask. Oh, it's MJ. <clears throat> hey, MJ. You're up late. Just catching up on the news. Looks like you had quite an adventure with Shocker tonight. Yeah, he was unusually combative. Anyway, thanks again for dinner. What do I owe you? How about a favor? You still have that mask from the gallery? Yeah. I'm actually on my way to the Feast Center now to ask Martin Lee about it. Martin Lee? Why? He has a degree in art history. If anyone knows about the origins of that mask, he will. Just keep me in the loop. Like I said, I think there's a bigger story here. And I plan to be the one to break it. Uh, sure. So I can call you, like, whenever? Yeah. Whenever, whatever. So I guess we're talking again. Cool. See if I can set her straight. You're on with J. Jonah James. I just want to say that I've never seen Manhattan so safe and peaceful. Compare what it was like when Spider Man first showed up to now. Okay, fair enough. I will. Then we had police and firefighters doing a wonderful job. There was crime, but nothing they couldn't handle. Of course, we do have things now we didn't have then maniacs who shoot electricity out of their eyes, walking piles of sand, Nazis made of bees. Didn't Spider-Man put all those guys in jail? You're missing the point! They didn't exist before he came along. At best, he attracts them. But I've often wondered if they're in cahoots. Wow. I've never actually heard anyone say cahoots before. Look, all I'm saying is, 
I'd hate to imagine what would have happened if all those guys showed up and Spider-Man wasn't here. Another lost cause. Goodbye. Two zero seven. Kidnapping reported. Please proceed to Park City. back up already when spider cops on the job come hell or high water the job gets nope 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 she'd never admit it but the chief was warming up to spider cop his casual disregard for by the book thinking was a breath of fresh air she'd come around someday Nasty car wreck down there. People might be hurt. Spider-Man! Help! I can't move! Carl crush that pedestrian if I don't do something! Debris is trapping someone inside that car. I've got you. Stay calm. <laughs> Victims are out of danger. Let's let the EMTs do their job now. The infamous dumpling recipe. Should have come with step 10. Try not to burn everything in MJ's apartment.
Wouldn't be New York without a seedy drug deal. Oh, come on, fellas. You can't keep ducking income tax like this. Drugs are maybe my most disliked criminal activity. Definitely top five. Or... You might have heard about the robbery at Roseman's auction house. What you probably didn't hear, but my sources confirm, is that the perpetrators were wearing masks. Horrible, demonic faces. Yet another example of the explosion in mass criminals since Spider-Man came on the scene. Let's hear your thoughts. You're on with J. Jonah Jackson. Yeah, I see your point, but Spider-Man stopped those guys today. Saying he's like them because he wears a mask isn't fair. It's like prejudice. Wrong! Here's a little lesson in the English language, my friend. Prejudice means to prejudge someone before you know anything about them. I know all I need to about Spider-Man. He runs around causing chaos, wearing a mask so he doesn't have to answer for his shenanigans, and a flashy costume so he gets attention to feed his gigantic name. Look, I know you've been hacking into our crime system towers. Wasn't me. I mean, what towers? I don't mind. In fact, I need your help. I think someone's jamming the system, and they must be using multiple jammers to cover the full frequency range. Could you take a look? If you help, I promise I won't tell anyone you're hacking us. I prefer to call it sharing, but sure. The jammers emit a signal I can detect. Just need to swing through the financial district and hunt for a signal. Found a signal. Just need to follow it. Any jamming devices would only be a... Fisk's men. This is my shock face. Gotta take out the jamming device. Shoddy workmanship. I just took out a jamming device. That do anything? No, but like I said, there's probably a bunch of them. Makes sense. I'll track them down. I wonder if Fisk's men had anything to do with the system going down in the first place. jamming party and didn't invite me. Thought we had a cop on the payroll keeping us off the crime. That was
Stand by, check it out. Dead now. <sighs> Just need to get rid of the gym. Sometimes breaking stuff is the answer. <laughs> and it's fun too. Spider-Man, it's working. I'm starting to get a weak signal. It's garbled, but I picked up something about Fisk and outfit. Fisk was the kingpin of crime, but he didn't deal in knockoff fashion. The sooner the system is fixed, the sooner we know what they're planning. Nothing's just only one jammer left. What tall buildings in the district haven't I checked yet? Thank you. 
jammers. I thought our guy on the inside disabled all the crime towers. Someone's been reactivating. We can't risk anyone seeing what we're up to. Found you. Now I just... Okay, that's the last of them. The system should be back online. Spider-Man! The crime system's working again! Great. Any more info on Fisk's men or those outfits? No, but the system's reporting unauthorized activity down by the docks. I'm sending coordinates now. I'll check it out. They escape. Planning to do with those, it's nothing good. Gotta find out what those guns are for. Open fire! Oh. Ah. Anyone's here? Are you gonna wish- oh, Shut your- 
Now maybe I can figure out what's going on. Guns, prison guard uniforms, and spoofed ID cards. They were planning to bust Fisk out of the raft. Sorry to spoil your prison break, guys. Hey, look! Looks like New York's finest have it from here. Everything's clear on my end, too. Thanks for restoring the system, Spider-Man. I won't tell anyone you're piggybacking on it, but if you get caught, you're on your own. I have no idea what you're talking about. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to delete my selfies from the crime system servers. This used graphing calculator at a pawn shop. Stopped working in the middle of a trig exam. Huh, you get what you pay for. The menu for my first real date. Folks, I have to once again defend myself against the spurious claims from McDonald Mac Gargan, aka the Scorpion. Yes, as I fully disclosed, I bankrolled the experiment that gave him superior strength, speed, and that unsightly cyborg tail. The idea was to create an anti-Spider-Man who is not a threat and stops menaces. I had no idea he was crazy. Do you think his resume said psycho with a poisoning fetish? His lawsuit is a transparent attempt to reduce his sentence at the raft by placing the blame for his deeds on me. And that is one package, J. Jonah Jameson. Attention units, a break-in was just reported. Report came in from Little Italy. God, how much I love photography. Looks like we've got some doorbusters. And it's not even Black Friday. Man, Fist goes away and suddenly it's amateur hour. <laughs>
jail, where I bet you'll be as good at breaking out as you were at breaking in. Maybe this will help me balance work and a personal life, if I ever find time to read it. Spider plushie! Ah, oh, a toy designer made this. Reserve the right to refuse service and knock out any criminals. Says so right on the sign. Crime would decline post Fisk. Might have been too optimistic. I'll text Yuri the look.
fortification. Cops will be here in no time. You've heard me express grave concerns about the risk to civil liberties posed by the police department's crime system. Tried mixing up a prototype web fluid at Oscorp while Harry had his internship there. Didn't work. That place has always been bad luck for me. 